Look at how beautiful it is. Yeah, this is what we all wanted. And we shall give this side another about a minute or two before we flip it again. Cooking up. Hi, this is Cooking Appa. I have a very beautiful snapper with me, not a very big one, roughly about 550 gram. Um, I wash it, cut few slits over the fish body, and we are going to marinate it with a little bit of fine salt, after which we're going to deep fry it. Now, before you deep fry, always remember to use a kitchen towel to wipe dry the fish so that it doesn't contain much water because that water it's going to make the oil splatter. Next step, you want to make sure you heat up some oil until the oil is starting to smoke. This is why they call it smoking point. And usually there is at least 180 degrees Celsius. I'm not sure you can see the smoke right now. It's already very smoky. Get a long spatula to help you to put in the fish as far as possible. <laughs> Papa is also scared of the oil, seriously. Now, uh, get, using a bigger wok can really help. But of course, when you are using a bigger wok, you will need to add in more oil as well. Yeah? So after you put in the fish, next thing, do not flip the fish so fast. Uh, let it stay and keep on frying on the higher heat for at least one to two minutes before we flip it over. Those of you who notice APA is using a standard steel today is because I would like to have a um, nicer fried fish which has a nicer char because um, standard steel can actually give a lot higher transmit much higher heat as compared to non-stick wok and you need to remember this frying fish you want high heat it will not get chow ta very uh, easy yeah? Fish will, uh, fried fish will not get chow ta too easily one. But of course you don't leave it in the oil for like 10 minutes like, huh? Few minutes is fine The wok I'm using uh, is actually 32 cm I think fish frying you really need a bigger wok or bigger pan Now if you compare to the normal non-stick wok that I'm using This one, this is actually 30 or 28, I can't remember It's either 28 or 30 and this one I'm using here, Dolphin Walk from uh, Thermos, Malaysia. This is 32. So after the first two minutes, we can now flip it over. You need to be very careful, get a long spatula to help. Look at the beautiful golden color that we are getting here. Look at how beautiful it is. You can't really get this color if you are using a non-stick wok because non-stick wok doesn't transmit very high heat. As a matter of fact, if you are using non-stick wok, you are not supposed to use too high heat. Right? So, frying fish is better to use uh, carbon steel or stainless steel. But the only thing is, carbon steel and stainless steel, if you don't know how to use it, it can stick quite easily. Lah. But just follow what I show you all just now. Um, clean the fish thoroughly. Then before you uh, <coughs> put in the fish, make sure your oil is smoking hot. You put in the fish, after which don't turn it so fast. Wait for a while before you flip it over. After the crust been formed at the bottom, then only you flip it over, then it will not stick. You, get, you will see something like what you are looking at right now. Beautiful, isn't it? Look at how beautiful it is. Yeah, this is what we all wanted. And we shall give this side another about a minute or two before we flip it again. After approximately two minutes, you can actually flip it over. The fish is basically cooked now. Total cooking time approximately about five minutes plus minus. Yeah. Look at how beautiful it is. Beautiful golden color. Right, it's basically done. Just want to get a little bit more color on the other side. Get ready an oil absorbing paper at the side. Look at how beautiful this fish is. It's done.
So here's a beautiful fish. Let me try to very quickly make a simple dipping sauce. All right, so I have some uh, chili padi. This is uh, kacai, calamansi. Cut some calamansi peel inside. Some light soya sauce. You can add some fish sauce also, or light soy sauce mix fish sauce. Up to you. Right, so I like. Uh, I hope you like my very simple dinner today. All the video you see, thousand over videos you see on my cooking channel. They are all my family dinner. Yeah, Appa cook for my family. I'm not a chef. I'm just a dad who cook for my family. All right, so um, if you like my video, do share my video on your Facebook to friends. Come to Cooking Appa Facebook fan page to click like and follow button. Follow up on Instagram and subscribe to Cooking Appa YouTube channel. You want to look for simple cooking ideas? Come to subscribe to Cooking Appa YouTube channel. Bye bye.